Jamie Hamby with Radiant Technology. I want to show you how our new universal airspeed indicator works. First of all, let's turn it on. And as you see when it comes up, it gives you the serial number and tells you that it's a Radiant instrument. It then lets you set up or down on your green speed, and then it switches over to your yellow speed, up or down, and then it switches over to your red speed, up or down, and then it'll switch over to your flap speed, up or down. You can set them as you like. It'll do this about eight times when you first buy the unit and thereafter it will always power up to this screen directly. If you don't get it right, you can reset the unit back to the factory configuration and do it all over again. Or if you change airplanes, you can reset everything up in the future. Let me show you how to operate the unit. I'm hooking it up to my airspeed simulator and we've got it hooked up to both ours and this old steam gauge at the same time. As we go up to, for instance, 100 and 60 knots you can see that we're showing 164 knots and we're showing 184 miles per hour over here hey i just decided i don't like miles per hour and i want to switch to knots all i got to do is hold down the units button for about six seconds and there we go and the unit will reboot let's see what happens when it comes back up this time oh this time we're just under 160 knots and it's showing us 159 knots cool as we reduce speed, you can see how we get a time trend over there. You can also see the big beautiful digits and how all the colors are matching up with the ranges that we set. Now we're gonna keep on going down, 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 and we get into the neighborhood of about 20 knots, we stop getting an indication. Let's see how fast we respond. I set it up to 150 there. You can see that, now I'm gonna disconnect it. This one goes down to zero, but we beat it because we're faster and we're just as smooth. That's basically how you operate it when you're in flight. You can change the scale, you can change the units. If you hold both buttons down at the same time when you're on the ground, you can recalibrate the zero set point anytime you want. Thanks for taking a look at the unit. Please buy it from Radiant Instruments. Have a good day.